DC and Marvel have both served up some mind-blowing male heroes, but the women are wondrous as well. It takes more than a costume and an attitude to do this work. If the two universes were to collide, which woman would reign supreme? Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we'll be counting down our picks for the top 10 superheroines of all time. I'm sure you could have handled these crooks without my help, but I was glad for the chance to join in the fun. For this list, we'll be combining both our DC superheroines and Marvel superheroines lists to see who's the best of the badass females. But hey, looks aren't everything. <laughs> if there's something missing you think should have made our ultimate list, be sure to check out our videos of the top 10 Marvel superheroines and top 10 DC superheroines to see how they rank in their respective universes. I wasn't sure if you were on the West Coast or, oh no. So slip on your spandex suit and get ready for battle between these members of the not so gentle sex. Well, I have learned one thing. It's not polite to hit a lady. Number 10, Elektra, Marvel Universe. My name's Elektra Nachos. One of the most complex Marvel characters, Elektra is a master of the martial arts and has a tortured relationship with the superhero Daredevil. Although she began her career as an assassin and has used her incredible skills for evil, she's also teamed up with the good guys on many occasions. Why not? You didn't turn out so bad. Elektra is ruthless and cunning, qualities that make her a valued ally and a fearsome opponent. She's also intensely determined. Even death was unable to claim her for very long. <laughs> Number nine, Black Widow, Marvel Universe. Who are you? Natasha Romanoff. Originally an elite Soviet sleeper agent, the Black Widow defected to the West and became one of the most valuable members of Nick Fury's S.H.I.E.L.D. team. Before I worked for S.H.I.E.L.D., I, uh, well, I made a name for myself. Though the Widow's abilities have been somewhat augmented, it's her physical prowess and keen strategic intellect that make her a force to be reckoned with. Thanks to her espionage background, the Black Widow can take on a number of roles and play them all convincingly, making her invaluable for infiltrating enemy organizations. Number 8, Miss Marvel, Marvel Universe. My name is Miss Marvel, and I'm here to welcome you to Earth. Created back in 1968, Carol Danvers was originally a determined security officer in the United States Air Force who developed superhuman powers due to an encounter that fused her DNA with that of an alien from the Kree race. If you really knew anything about humanity, you'd know we could never do what you're asking. Now blessed with a wide range of powers, including super strength, flight, super speed, and photonic blasts, she began her heroic career as Miss Marvel. Join the Avengers. I don't know what to say. A member of many incarnations of the Avengers, Carol recently assumed the name of Captain Marvel, with the name of Miss Marvel being passed on to a teenage girl named Kamala Khan. I believe in you. I name myself after you. Number seven, Rogue, Marvel Universe. It was an accident. Until she gained control over her powers, things were rough for Rogue. The first boy I ever kissed ended up in a coma for three weeks. She couldn't touch anyone without draining them of their memories, strengths, and abilities. When people touch my skin, something happens. What? I don't know. They just get hurt. Once she learned how to control her abilities, things became easier, though not perfect. What's wrong is I can't touch my boyfriend without killing him. Other than that, I'm wonderful. Along the way, Rogue absorbed Miss Marvel's powers and personality, and found herself battling the superheroine for control over her own body. Acting like a sponge for other mutants' powers, Rogue is not someone to be trifled with. <laughs> Number 6, The Invisible Woman, Marvel Universe. I think you both know my director of genetic research, Susan Storm. One of Marvel's most iconic characters, The Invisible Woman is one of the original members of the Fantastic Four. We're all in this together, Ben. Together? Participating in an experimental starship flight, Cosmic Rays gave Susan Storm Richards the power to turn invisible and to create force fields of amazing strength. Look at me! Sue, look at your hands. Over the years, the Invisible Woman has learned to manipulate her force fields to incredible effect, enabling her to levitate or cause objects to explode. Oh. 
And as Sue's confidence has grown, so has the intensity of her power. Let's not fight. No, let's. Number five, Storm, Marvel Universe. I'd like you to meet Aurora Monroe, also called Storm. With her ability to totally control the weather, Storm is quite literally a force of nature and not one to be messed with. Sometimes anger can help you survive. Orphaned at an early age, a witch priestess took Storm under her wing and taught her how to control and use her mighty powers. Storm has been a longtime member and sometimes leader of the X-Men, and it's her insight and commanding presence, along with her awesome powers, that make her one of the team's most important members. Do you know what happens to a toad when it's struck by lightning? The same thing that happens to everything else. Number four, Batgirl, DC Universe. And you are? Batgirl. Batgirl's cape and cowl have been donned by several people, but Barbara Gordon remains the person most identified with the character. If I don't ace these midterms, Dad says he'll throw me in jail. And with my dad, that's no idle threat. Daughter of Gotham City Police Commissioner James Gordon, Barbara started her Batgirl career by accident. She was dressed up for a costume party when she encountered a criminal situation. My dual identity, and you must swear never to reveal it to anyone. Barbara's Batgirl career was interrupted for several years after she was paralyzed by the Joker. But even then, she continued fighting crime behind the scenes as Batman's technical advisor, Oracle. Not for a very long time. Her subsequent return to the Batgirl mantle promises new heights of glory for the unsinkable heroine. If you won't let me help you, what else can I do? Good. You've got some sense after all. Number three, Jean Grey, Marvel Universe. Jean! I know you're still there! Whether calling herself Marvel Girl, Red, Miss Psyche, or White Phoenix of the Crown, Jean Grey has been a starring player in the Marvel Universe for more than five decades. I keep feeling something terrible is about to happen. Jean has made a definitive impression from her debut in the first issue of X-Men, but gained true legendary status during the epic Dark Phoenix storyline. For your own good, Jean. Stay out of my head. In her experiences, both good and bad, with the Phoenix Force, Jean has achieved a level of power that is truly godlike. I can move things with my mind. Really? What kinds of things? All kinds of things. But even when working without the Phoenix, her telekinetic powers demand respect. Jaden, enough. Enough! Number two, Supergirl, DC Universe. We both know how this is gonna turn out. The real Kara Zor-El, Kara Zor-El from Earth One, better known as Supergirl, is the cousin to the Man of Steel. You're uh, Superman's best friend, huh? No, his cousin. Like Superman, she is the survivor of the planet Krypton, and so the lesser gravity of Earth, combined with the solar energy from Earth's yellow sun, give her a range of mighty superpowers. <gasps> the original Supergirl gave her life in the Crisis on Infinite Earth series. Subsequent versions of the character altered her origin so she was actually no longer from Krypton. I had to come back to the one place in the universe I have family. However, the most recent reboot has returned Supergirl to her rightful Kryptonian heritage. Before we reveal our top pick, here are a few honorable mentions. I am sorry to disappoint you, but I am stronger than I look. Good. I was looking for a fight. You give theoretical physicists a bad name. Now knock it off before I make you. It's a portal into my mind, not a toy! You can stop trying to read my mind, sugar. You're never going to get anything from me while I'm like this. Number one, Wonder Woman, DC Universe. Look, it's Wonder Woman! Along with Batman and Superman, Wonder Woman completes the big three of DC Comics' most iconic characters. You must now tell the truth. <coughs> you are working with the Falcon. Raised on an isolated island by a race of Amazons, Princess Diana assumed the mantle of Wonder Woman when she came to the world of men. Here, she fights for justice and liberty for all people. Her super strength, flying ability, 
and Magic Lasso, buttressed by her warrior training, make her a formidable opponent. But her greatest asset may be as a cultural symbol who has inspired and empowered countless girls and women to follow. Wonder Woman, Wonder Woman. Do you agree with our choices? You don't know me at all. Which Heine kicking heroine do you think deserved a spot on this list? For more enthralling top tens published every day, be sure to subscribe to WatchMojo.com. Not alone, but what about together? They're all part of who you are, right?